this revelation today from the president, his big reveal, I guess, in reality TV terms, that there are, in fact, no tapes of Jim Comey. Do you agree um, with your colleague in the House, uh, Adam Schiff, who thinks that the original tweet may constitute something more serious than simply a bluff, that it may have been an effort to silence a witness? Oh, absolutely. Uh, he, it, was, it looks like a, an attempt at intimidation. If, if you don't have tapes and you say that, you're basically trying to persuade persuade someone not to t testify and and that wasn't the only time he's done that he's he pressured him when he was in in the office so uh, and he's pressured other individuals and certainly uh, Dan Coats and and so forth and so we see case after case after case a president obsessed with Russia and wanting to suppress the conversation that makes it certainly very susp suspicious not to suppress it but it seems to want to use the heads of the uh, intelligence agencies to rapidly respond to press accounts of them. I mean, are you interested in hearing more from Director of National Intelligence Coates and from NSA Director Emma Rogers? Oh, oh, absolutely. And I know that at the moment, most of the, the really interesting testimony will be in private with the Senate Intelligence Committee and the House Intelligence Committee. But the American people have a right to know what's going on with the things that are unclassified, that are about real conversations in the White House over these issues. Uh, we need to uh, hear what's going on. Do you think the original tweet constituted obstruction of justice? It certainly constituted pressure. Uh, and uh, I'll leave it to the lawyers to say if it's obstruction of justice. but. He has now many times attempted to slow down and block and uh, discount this investigation, and uh, it adds up to a pretty strong case of somebody. It's in a and a non-lawyer. I'm not a lawyer. From a non-lawyer's point either. of view, we're hopeless. <laughs> yeah, this is absolutely a president trying to derail an investigation. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.